Billions of years of evolutionary advancement. And then we have Cassie. What? No, what? Is it because I slept in your bed? Happy day, I'm glad. <laughs> I'm very excited today because we are going to check out We Happy Few. I'm gonna take a little bit more of a sincere look at this game. It reminds me of a lot of my favorite novels, like my favorite dystopian societies where governments look down on people and control them. And, you know, Big Brother's watching you. It is here and we're gonna start a new game. I'm very, very excited. Permadeath? Just by looking at this title screen, we got this guy saying wakey wakey. We've got the news on the streets. Seems like there's control here. We've got Miss Terry's cleaners. Yeah, that's when you know it's gonna be evil. That's when you know. Terry's cleaners is and a fine establishment. You don't just have it on one side though, you have it on two. Why are you, why are you on both? Because why is your mom doing laundry on both? Lots of people need to be clean in this society. I'm sure they do. Happy is the country with no past. Ooh. Got to censor the past. We've got to make sure people don't know the truth. And I feel like we even kind of do that sometimes in Canada. Like we don't, we don't really learn in schools the full extent of what we've done. I mean, we kind of just like brush over it, but we don't really talk about it the way we should. At least not until university, anyway. Oh, space bar. Let's go. Here I am. What am I doing? That is a redactor. I'm taking a little tube, throwing it in here, and it looks to me like I'm reviewing newspapers. Okay, so she wins a garden prize. That's Pretty vanilla, pretty acceptable, yeah. Approved, definitely. I mean, you gotta keep the people entertained, so we're gonna send that out there. No swimming in the river. There's no truth oh, to the river. No. Toxic chemicals, no, we can't let the people know about that. Absolutely not. They'll get scared. Just let them keep swimming in the river. I, I don't care if they get Ebola, it's fine. So my guy, he's very obedient. He's obviously under the hand of Big Brother. Hasten Brothers win scrap gathering. Oh, God. It appears that I'm having a flashback and freaking out right now. Uh, why is this? And this is pretty, like, pretty clean news. Why is it making me freak out? I'm taking some pills. When life annoys, top up your joy. Joy. So I take a pill called joy when I think about the past. I don't like thinking about the past. My depression roots from the past, and sometimes you just gotta medicate yourself, so... I should just take my joy, shouldn't I? I, I don't think so. I mean, it'll make you happier, but is that... Oh, no. Alright, so I can either keep remembering, or I can take joy and be like, Ah, that didn't happen. I'm gonna keep remembering. I mean, it's not... It's not the happy thing to do, but it's the real thing to do! I gotta stare in here! No one else is gonna know it except me! Ooh, I threw my joy Percy! Away. Is this my brother? Percy! Percy! What happened to you? I miss you, man! What did Big Brother do to you? Ah, we used to win prizes together! It's a cool clock, though. What have you been up to? Ah! No one's seen you for hours. Why are you wearing- oh, Nose to the grindstone. You know. Then why haven't I heard a single whoosh through the door since ten o'clock? This is the did you forget we're having happy? Deirdre's birthday party? Oh. We've got a pinata. Oh, did ya? Right. Those are happy. Brilliant. Of course. Oh, don't. Have you forgotten your joy? <laughs> of course not. Snug as a mug on a drug. Well, come on then. Finish up. Uh, oh, good. Just have a few more pages. Uh, I know you're very busy. Then don't take too long to finish. Are you taking my joy? <gasps> wow. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, but I the threw that joy on the floor. She just took oh, it. She was just popping do? pills. Left and right, staying oh, happy, I guess, in the society. A lot of different drugs are are kind of suppressed, but not the joy. Everyone needs to be happy. That's the only thing we care about here. Now, here is a power cell. Now, presumably, I can just put this... Now, let's see what this says here. Wellington Wells. And there's, like, the painted face. The painted face seems to be a normal thing. Why are you staring at me over I here? I love what you've done with your office. Thanks. It's so... Homey. Homey. It looks like a modern futuristic death well where people who have money go. Look at my little cube chair. I sit in this and pretend I'm happy. And this thing, I probably love not even a lot. You've done Shut with up. your office. Okay, I get it's it. So I get it. You like my homey. my little my color coded office. Now I'm gonna. Oh, gotta put that power cell in there. And I'm gonna sit down. Oh no, do I accept or censor the document? <gasps> Let's just see what this is about. Percival and Arthur Hastings were surprise winners at the scrap drive. Seems clean enough. Arthur told the judges that his brother has a photographic memory. Percy knew exactly where all the old cars and prams and things were in the Guardian district. Percival himself rarely speaks to strangers, apparently. The scrap will be melted down to be used to support the war effort against the Soviet Union, which is by all reports going splendidly! The brothers brought in a record 1,654 pounds of scrap steel, winning them some 50 pounds. 
And victory against communism bond. Well, surely. I mean, but what if we're not at war against these people anymore? It seems like a good document, but is it? What if I put my brother in danger by not censoring the document? Because they'll be like, he has photographic memory! But I don't want to turn on my own brother. Okay, we're accepting this document. We're brothers. I'll always look after you. You know that. Aww. The idea is to forget our nightmare, Martha. Not enshrined. Or... Did she just- does she know what How I just did? No. Well? Everyone's I expect watching you me. in the conference room presently. Okay. Don't dawdle. You don't want to miss the piñata. Okay, what is this? Um, wasn't Prudence supposed to be coming back today? I made her a welcome back card. All children who will be under the age of 13 by July 22nd must be registered with the authority. General Bing clarified that the deadline for the registration is next Thursday. He refused to speculate on the rationale for the registration regulation. So there's a regulation here where all children who are under the age of 13 have to be registered. And I feel like this will start, like, everyone's going to be like, why? why? Everyone's going to be asking the right questions if I don't censor this document. So I'm just going to go ahead and censor it. Oh, that's probably going to get me. It's probably going to get me later. We'll see. The first rounds of a new trial of another anti-melancholic medication, an antidepressant, maybe another form of joy. The drug reduced the melancholic feelings in 28% out of 30 despondent rats over a 20-day period. Everyone takes joy. Everyone knows about it. I'm just going to go ahead and accept that document. It's got to be okay. Well, it's gone down the tube now. And that's all my work for today. All right. Let's stand up. Take a little walk. Arthur Hastings, Employee of the Year. That's me. Until they see that I published that paper of me and my brother. Wow. Pretty beautiful outside. Nice architecture. I mean, we're living in a dystopian dictatorship, but at least the architecture is nice. Beauty is truth. Oh, I'm sure it is. Uh, now, let's... Oh. Clive Birth Whistle. You're off at the party, aren't you? All right, so this is another person who's probably at the birthday party right now. This is a letter for their office. And it says, if Prue doesn't return soon, I don't see why you couldn't have her office. In the meantime, I suggest you pop another joy and you'll feel sunshine on your face, whether you have a window or not. So you can sit in your dark, sad office and no one will ever know. But where did that person Prue go? Where, where did Prue disappear to? Looks like this person had a bit of a mental breakdown. It's very, very messy office. There's a red line here. Restricted area. No unauthorized personnel beyond this point. Uh, should I cross the point? Eee! Ooh, let's see what's in his redacta. Yes. Ooh, yes. Ooh. Farm workers expected to return from Germany. Okay, now are we still fighting the Eastern Front? Or are we against the Western Front? I don't know. Seems good enough, right? Should I really be doing this with someone else's documents, though? I'm gonna prove it. Okay, I'm really digging myself into a hole right now. 64, how is that 2064? Is that 1964? The following stations will be served from one hour after curfew ends to one hour before curfew begins. Okay. The Wellington, under so like transport beyond curfew is open. We obviously gotta censor that, but I'm glad I know it's there. Don't want people running around at night when we're trying to control them. I am employee of the year, by the way. Oh, let's stand up. What did he break? Trencherman's gin. Oh, wow. He broke his gin. We're allowed to drink booze? All right, heading to the party. Where's the booze? Actually, let's... Okay. We're heading to the party. It's booze time. Right after... What happened to you, Prudence? Now, what happened to you, Prudence? Prue. Oh, Prue! So the guy who smashed his bottle is gonna take this person's office. And there's flies and sausage and there's Pepperidge Farms here. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and close this door because I'm a little paranoid. I'd like to know what's going on here. Prudence, what's your problem? What is your problem? Okay, sit down. Okay. Now it's time to find out the truth. The new and exciting exposition, Bolshevism against Europe had- I'm just gonna read this for a sec, see what's going on. Visitors will learn how to be alert for communist conspiracies and propaganda. So this is like a basic brainwashing machine. Um, I'm gonna say fine. Hopefully. I mean, as long as we know who our enemies are, right? And it's Prudence too. <laughs> it's under Prudence's name, so it's fine. Your baby's waiting, tripe free. Eat tripe, grow strong. So everyone here maybe is a little bit malnourished because we be eating tripe. All the time, I mean, and there's nothing wrong with tripe, but it's kind of a cheap meat. It's like intestinal, intestinal meat. It's what you get in your fun. You're like, 
I'm fine, thanks. Owners are to bring their vehicles, which must contain at least one quarter full tank of gas, to the train station. You'll get a fine of $100 if you don't turn in your car that you bought and paid for with some gas in it to these guys. I mean, sure, let's approve it. I mean, they might as well know about it, otherwise they're gonna have the fine, right? Yeah, I don't like the flies buzzing around while I'm trying to work. I don't even know why I'm doing Prudence's work for him. Him? Or Share the meat! While we are waiting for cattle stocks to recover across the bridge, remember to consume meat responsibly. Oh, and that's why they're coming out with ads now that are like, Eat tripe, it's good for you, it's the best meat in the world. Okay, it's the flower parade. Sounds nice. We're all amazed at how many different varieties of exotic flowers she's grown, all while helping feeding her family with vegetables. That sounds good. Sounds good to me. What could possibly go wrong, right? Okay, that this happens to be the last one, so let's make sure it's good. Police arrest four in breeder riot. One man named Ranulf Elderly and three unnamed women were arrested in what police are calling another breeder riot breeders. So maybe they're calling people who want to have kids breeders? I'm not sure yet. The victim, Miss Anne McCutcheon, appears to be in stable condition, as is her husband. There is no word yet on the condition of her baby, whose birth was not expected for another two months. What is going on here? The arrested police officer stated, it is dangerous for women who are in a family way to strut their condition about. Frankly, it sets people off when decent folk are doing the best to forget. Maybe we're taking this joy stuff and it's kind of like birth control. Maybe they're like, maybe they want to control the rate at which we breed, or maybe we're sterile because there was a nuclear war and that's why people are doing their best to forget pregnancy. I'm not quite sure, but I'm gonna go ahead and sense. Cause it shows unrest. I'm gonna censor it. I'm just trying to do, I'm just trying to work on behalf of the state. Okay, and prudence. <laughs> okay, so thank you prudence. I'm, I'm not quite sure I learned much. Let's You're examine. not coming back, are you Prue? Where did you go? Yeah, where'd you go, bud? I try to do your work as well as possible. Censored a few things. Winner, best attitude, and grand prize winner. This just goes to show that the state will turn on you, even if you're an upstanding citizen. What's going on here? Now, I haven't taken my joy I today, my joy. so... I took my joy! No, no, leave me alone. Excuse me. No. Oh, hi, Arthur. No, don't you dare. No, I shouldn't have been there for so long. Oh, shit! Oh! We seem to be a bit behind in our work now that you mention it. Why would that little kid just wave at me? Who are you? Are you that doctor guy that was that was just looking at me? I swear it's the same guy. Ew. Oh god. Odd. I never noticed that. I can't. We should fix that or empty the bucket at least. Come on, guys. Clean up after yourselves. Look at all this, all this debris just flying in the air, all this shit here. All right, here we are. There you are. You nearly missed the piñata. Um, it's the most adorable Spanish custom. What are we, 12? Uncle Jack did a whole show about it. You smash it until all the candy comes I'm out. I'm gonna need a lot of booze and a lot of joy to Come find on. this fun. Hit it! Hit it! I don't know, guys. Like, hit should it. I? Smash it, oh, silly face it. off! Are you sure? Hit it! Hit it! Smash, smash it. it! Really smash, smash it! Oh, okay, okay, fine. Let's just smash this thing. Whoa! What the? No! Uh. Little low on meat here, aren't we? Oh! You are off your job. No, I'm not. Take I usually love r rats. Oh my lord, he's a downer. Oh, what? What is on security? We've got a downer. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Okay. Do yeah. yeah. Oh, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Probably a bad time to ask for that raise. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I gotta go. I gotta go. What do I do here? There's gotta be something I can do. Okay, let's crouch. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. No! No! Oh Jesus. Oh boy. Okay, I gotta find some way to kill these guys. I gotta kill him. I'm gonna hit him with this wrench. No! Is there a better way I could have gotten out of that situation? I was trying to smack him like I smacked the pinata, but it doesn't really look like I uh, did did good. Don't let the black dog in. Who's that? Good. 
Christ. I can't believe I'm still alive. More or less. Ow. Now people are going to be leaving rotting meat Feels to like I lost office. an argument well, with a train. What's going on today in the village of I can't go back. I've got to get out of here. Circus is coming to town. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and turn that off. It's really annoying. Ah. I'm going to take them all. First aid kit is now available in your journal. Ooh, filtered water. Gonna need some of that. Open my personal safe. Ooh, what do we got? Ooh, we got booze up in here. Makes you witty, attractive, and invincible. <laughs> Not really. Dirty bandage. Okay, so this is like the this is the background stuff. Hi, mate. Who's that? It's Mrs. Stokes. Excuse me. Can I just borrow this? Uh, it's empty. It's empty. This old lady's empty. What the hell? And my hand gestures aren't doing much better. This is Stokes' letters. Wait, examine chair? And it looks like she's gone off her rocker. Where am I? If only I could flee to the mainland. There must be some people out there. Otherwise, who the hell did we trade food with for all those years? But the bridge is in the parade district. Oh, so there is a parade coming for flowers. Maybe I could sneak around? I suppose there is that subway hatch Stanley was always nattering on about on Appleholm. The subway that's open after hours. I'm glad that I paid attention. Stanley said one of his mates had a boat in there. That ridiculous man, always talking rubbish. They've been dumping poison on Appleholm for years. The fumes will kill you in half a minute. Why on earth did I marry such an idiot? I miss him so. Living in the sewers, yeah. It's a good life. Got a dead body hanging in my house. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead. Okay, it's closed. Do not open. I've got to go to St. George's home. It won't be easy. They have gates on the bridges to keep out people like me. People like me? You okay? Ah, uh, but that was in another country. Who was Uncle Jack before he was Uncle Jack? I, I can't remember. I can't remember what you're talking about. Everyone's like upset. Ah, but where's Kilwood when you need him, eh? Oedipus didn't know what he was doing. What? How are you doing? I'm late. I'm late you're for a very important date. Here. Mind the side effects. Boys. Oh, but there's a big one. How about you? You look normal. Ah, but where's Kilroy when you need him, eh? Feet meet hot. Feet meet cold. Feet meet in the pot nine days old. There's gotta be someone I can take down. I'm gonna take you down. Oh, give him food. That's my house, right there. You can see it from... I've just lost my way, Constable. I don't actually live out here. Mm. No, I'm not gonna give you my water, thanks. I need my water for myself. Thank you very much. I'll tell you a secret. Remember bread? Remember bread? All right, so it just said I'm hungry. There's got to be some food I can find around here. Where's the food? It looks like this place was Remember blown to smithereens. Well, this is pretty. Nature is nice, but then you look at the city and it's like, eh. Don't believe. Okay, what is takedown? Let's just try it. Okay. Let's search this rubble pile. There's nothing in there. Enhanced rock is now available in your journal. Okay. I'm gonna drop this. <laughs> Oops. How about you? I'll take your ass down. No, I won't do that. I kind of feel bad that I just killed that woman. Maybe I'll. I'm just gonna hide her real quick. All right, come on, lady. You can't kill all of us. Oh shit! I I'll try. Ah. Uh, shit. Uh, Die! Uh, I don't want people to know what I've done. Now we see the violence inherent in the system. He kind of looks like he's sitting there, but I'm just gonna go ahead and drop him here. There he is. That's great. And you too. Oh, dang. I just killed two people. Should not have done that. Did someone see me? Okay. I'm searching the rubble for a bite of bread. Really like a bite of bread. Well, this looks a little nicer in here. Sit and read. Now, what's going on today? New joy flavor soon. Coconut. Okay. So we get to take coconut bullshit. Go away. I knew Uncle Jack before he was happy. Hi. Mom, Dad, I've come home. Mm. Hi, George. Are we mad? So or is it the world? I wish I died in the bombings. Okay, good talking to you. I'm gonna steal a little duct tape. I'm gonna steal a little torch. Ooh. Oh, there's lots of stuff in here I can use. Is there a bed upstairs? I'm pretty tired. How about you? He wasn't there again today. Oh, wish he'd stay away. V me hot. The V me gold. V me. 
It's gotta be a bed. Oh yeah, I'm gonna sleep, baby. Uh, good night. I gotta find food somehow. What? No, what? Is it because I slept in your bed? What's the problem? What's the problem? Oh my goodness, everyone's fighting me. Oh no, okay, I, I think I might have to redo a few things because oh, killing everyone seems kind of dumb. Seems kind of stupid, but what can you do? I'm a, I'm a much better... Okay, I'm gonna get some headshots, actually. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Search the toilet. There's gotta be something in there. What's going on and why is everyone fighting me? Play a chord. Cute. I need to have a better understanding of... Oh. The girl said, I don't recall inviting you. That's probably why. I'm dying. I'm really thirsty. I need to eat something right now. Not so yummy and you still get stinky breath and it's rotten. Okay. So I'm gonna use that onion. I'm always hungry. There's gotta be something I can eat. Jerky. Okay, so I've got some jerky for when I get super hungry. Otherwise, we gotta find our way to St. George's home. I don't know where that is. I'm just gonna check out my map really quick and see where we can go. Okay, safe house, ruined house, ruined house. This is the only place I've explored so far, so I gotta do a little bit more exploring so I can put my map on a little more. Hopefully I don't have to kill anybody. I don't like how it's nighttime. It's kind of freaky, scary. Somebody needs to work on these roads. No wonder we gotta take some joy to stay happy. What's in here? Hold E, disarm tin can. I don't have a clever trap tool. I gotta go find some stuff. I suppose I got fired from my job, huh? They won't be needing me back there again. But I know what the people at the top are doing. Smashing pinatas and eating rat guts. I mean, is this even much worse? Can I mug somebody and take their clothes? Oh. I don't know you. This is where I needed to go. Hello. We would like to know if you are who you appear to be. Can you tell me kindly who won Simon Says Simon last says. Friday? Right, it was Harry, wasn't it? it uh, Harry J Jones. Uh, Har Har Harry. It's not looking good. Uh, Larry. Uh, am I getting warmer? No? Get yourself back to the garden, you downer bastard. What? Oh. I'm in the area for downers, and the other side is people who take joy, so I'm literally in the ruins. And they get to live in the nice place over there! I gotta find out who Juan Simon says. Ugh. Hey! Who Juan Simon says? The Ravens are gone from the tower. Don't tell anyone! Mind the side effects. Shut up. We're just slumming it over here. People are starving. I'm starving. I'm thirsty. Piss off, you! Don't be mean to me. Ooh, a rotten mushroom. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to eat that. Ew. Oh, maybe I should lie down. Lie down, you feel queasy. Okay. Oh boy! Hopefully that wasn't a magic mushroom. Can I sleep on there? No? People don't sleep on benches here? The vomit is coming, the vomit is coming. Oh, uh. I should have taken my joy. It seems like I'm saying weird stuff too. Like, I'm crazy as well. Been off my meds for a while and it's kind of... I mean, I must be coming down, like, having symptoms or something. Oh, and I'm dizzy like that. It's awful. But I'm finally fine. I no longer have food poisoning. Oh, that was hard to beat. <gasps> Water. Get out of the way. You are not wanted here. Back off, you. Oh, I'm gonna fill my container. Oh, yeah. I'm just gonna drink it. Oh, yeah, it's good. Why'd you take the vanilla? Where can I find who Juan Simon says? Someone's gotta know. So, we meet again. London Bridge has fallen down. Fallen down. Okay, I assume she doesn't know. Down. The Jimmy London Bar. Bridge I gotta find some tools and break into these houses and find out who Juan Simon says. Oh, what is this? Get off, you. The station. Ooh. Ooh, a slice of pie. Oh, you know I'm taking that. Crafting a lock pick right now. I'm gonna pick this lock. Canteen. Take that. There's nothing else in there. Pump repair kit. I need to find a pump repair kit. What? I need a pipe valve. Oh boy. Who's crying? Jeez. I need to get back to my house because I'm very tired and then I need to find several different things like a pump thing. 
just, I, I gotta find everything. So I'm starting to get a feel for how to play this game. I've got to do a lot of exploring and unlocking, collecting, and not just killing random people in the streets. Let me know what you think about this game so far and if you'd like me to continue. If you enjoyed this video, please give it one of these and make sure you subscribe. Give that gloomy subscribe button a bit of a pick-me-up. I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!